Hello everyone and welcome back to 7 Days to Die with me and Lady Shelab. Say hello Lady Shelab. Hi everyone. It is day 44. We have a beautiful 4x4 up there. Look at how glorious it is. I need to make a slight, uh, we needed to make a slight adjustment to our loading area, but that is fine. It is we worth do. it. Yes. Um, and I am in the process of preparing this area to receive uh, deliveries into dump chests, which will then be available in the um, in the area down below. In the and uh, I am preparing the area down below. In the workshop down below. Now, I'm doing pretty well. Part of this is going to involve taking all of this back just a little bit further, because I have adjusted my plans somewhat. But it will look glorious. It'll totally be worth it. There we go. And. That will kind of be enough, but I'll take this down one more level. Uh, right, I need quite a few flagstone blocks. Now, what we're going to be doing today is probably... Mm, I'm thinking... Uh, just going and doing some questing? What do you think, Shelab? I think so, yeah. And then by We've night, I'll probably much. work on my farm or the, uh, the workshop down below with the tree lab. No, I just work on some, some of the walls and the, yeah, you can see the workshop down below and all that sort of thing. I think I'm going to need Two one doors. I wonder what they made those for. Yeah, there we go. Let's pop these all in place. Now I've got a connected wall at the back. And we're going to want Something similar at the front as well. There we go. Need three too many. Damn me. Uh, right, need four of these. This should look quite beautiful when it's done. Quite, quite beautiful. There we go. And let's get these in place. Of course, you can no doubt see what I'm doing now. I'm building a little arch. In our um, dump chest room. It is literally because just an arch for our dump chest room. We don't have enough arches. That's quite correct. We do not. I I am very glad that you understand. I'll grab a candle yep. from elsewhere. Let's pop this one in here. Look oh, at that. Cool. It is beautiful. I do need another candle now, though. Uh, they should both be in here. There we are. All right. So, with that done, we're going to go off and complete my last level three quest. And then I should be able to hand that in. Oh, there's a witch up top side. And with that done, oh, we'll oh. be able to get our level fours. Yeah. I'm actually really, really... Pretty really interesting. Yeah, yeah. Looking forward to, to those three... Six, nine in total I need. Let's be using nine flagstones, please. And then I'm going to go grab the nails and wood that I need to finish off that area. Well, we're going to need, we're going to need a fair amount of nails, I think, to make quite a large amount of... Well, I say large amount. Probably only going to go with three three uh, dump chests. Yeah. I don't think we need more than that. No. Not for, like, just a few days' worth. I will grab all of that, though. Uh, I will make all of this into cobblestone rocks while I can. And just because I can. Yeah. This corridor is starting to look quite swanky, I must say. Uh, even if I say so myself. Look at that. Oh, hello. Hi. Oh, replacing that with wood. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. With the cobblestone, flagstone, because... What is that? It looks stupid on the ceiling. Oh, let me drop down. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah I can see. So, I'm going to see how it Well, I mean, you didn't need to do that. We could just paint the ceiling. But, yeah. That makes sense. That's true. I'd forgotten that we could paint the ceiling, but... Uh, there's a room back I've never here. actually played together. with painting in this game before. I'm doing quite well. I must say, I'm quite impressed. 
Uh, don't need the clay side. Yeah, that's what I thought would happen. It's just like a little stripe of uh, flag across the corridor, which looks quite neat. Whereas down there, it looked really janky that it wasn't. Yeah, that's much better. Make as much cement as you can. There we go. All right. I think we are in a fairly solid position right now, Sheila. Fantastic. Oh, excuse me. Sorry, I shut the door on you. That's okay. I'm going to need another door, but I don't think we're going to use a vault door. I think uh, just a regular wooden door should be fine. I was going to say, I've mostly just used wooden doors around the place. We've got an iron door, actually. Um, if I can get into the building supplies chest. Yes, we do. Waste not, want not, I suppose. Um, Where's rotten flesh going nowadays? In the bin. Go on, pop that there. There we go. Iron door. Excellent. Now, we could have this place just full. This floor. Absolutely full of... Uh, of dump chests, but I yeah. think two should be more than enough. I think any more than that, and we're just putting it down for the sake of having we're just, it. We're just asking for a mess, aren't we, really? That was a power swing. It takes up the entire block in one go. That's actually not too bad. And dunk, and dunk. Such a pretty base now. Right, now, hopefully, that will work. Let's uh, head up and just have a quick test. Can I access the Jeep from here? I can. Oh, I got in the Jeep. Once again, I... But that was, that the, was your uh, fault for not like pressing E for long enough. Yeah, I know. Uh, right, yeah. so I can take the first aid kits, take all of these munchies and things from there. And unfortunately, I can't reach the tools down there. Oh. Right, so oh, so they had to be to they be. had to be higher up. That's right, they had to be higher up on the f in the ceiling. I forgot we went through the the whole thing of lifting these up yeah. by one. You might want to put like a yeah ramp and a frame underneath. Yeah, that was my bad. Or do something along those lines. Well, we've got to have access to this from below as well, and below is even further up. Mm. We're gonna have to create a a a uh, oh that ooh. the other thing is it may be that we can't reach it because of the bars. Let, yeah, yeah, before that was, I um... get rid of that, then let me have a quick look. Because the idea was to have bars there because it would then pose a difficult prospect for any zombies. If they saw the bars, they wouldn't necessarily tr want to try and go through them because it would take them a long time. I need to eat some food. Om nom nom. Yeah, my food is actually getting quite low. Well done. I'm going to go and see if I can access that because certainly that's the way with the Jeep. Oh, wow, the four yeah. by four. No, I can't access it when it's in the ground like that. All right. Okay. Well, that's a bit of a shame. Um, but there, there's a lot worse that could have been done. And again, pop. Uh, okay, so, frame, wooden frames at this point. I kind of want a, ooh, I'm gonna make, need to make a circular saw. Hadn't considered that. What? Either. Uh, what, because of the making wooden, um, you could just make them out of flag. I could. Ah, uh, but why? Why do that when I why? could instead... Why? When you could make a circular saw. Well, yeah. It gives me a reason to make a circular saw. Uh, where are we? Table saw, rather. Uh, I need mechanical parts, oh, electrical I parts, and I've away to go questing, and uh, now we're not questing. Let us get it all it's out It's fine. It's fine. We will absolutely be doing that shortly. It does. I'm just going to set it to be made more than anything else. Gonna take a minute and thirty-four to get that, but then we'll be able to make some nice fancy wooden frame shapes. Yeah. Okay, dropping off all my stuff so that we can go on the hunt. 
Uh, we don't need all of that forged steel, so we don't need it on me at any rate. Um, nor do we need all of that forged iron. I do want some forged steel for repairs. There we go. Just yeah. go round upgrading all the zombies' houses. <laughs> I mean, we could do. Forged steel. Uh, I'm not really sure by we accident. want to. That's what I mean, you do it by could. accident if you have a load of forged steel in your inventory. Oh, right, yeah, yeah. You go into the house and you'd be like, ah, oh, because everything in this game is upgradable, so... That is actually a really good point, yeah. No, oh, absolutely. Okay, so there we are then. Um, I'm going to bring all my tools along. I will go deploy the um, electric fences. I just won't set them up. Okay. One, two, and... Three and four. There we go. Perfect. Right then, I think uh, fell down the second time. I think it's time for us to head up to our quests. Uh, we've got a little horde of zombies. Yeah. And by little, I mean not that little, actually. They are regular zombies, though. It's just a regular so wandering horde. So, let's go over there and get involved. I'm just going to melee rather than uh, use up, up my arrows. Rather than waste your... Yeah. Well, I gave myself a little strength upgrade recently, so I, I'll go from the back. I'll start with Mo over here. Okay. No stamina at all. Melee is going to be bad. Ooh, my stamina is very bad, yeah. Uh, it should be okay. There we go. They're all down for the count. The old. Heavy attack followed up with a regular attack. As long as you hit the head, you should kill them. Oh, watch out, you are being flanked. Yes, I am being flanked. I realize this. I think uh, taking damage probably tipped you off. Yes. Don't know if he's down. Yes. So. Yes, he is. Okay. Well, uh, unfortunately. We're massive derps, and after our tea break, we didn't join a party, so we weren't sharing any XP though, but oh well. Ah, oh, that sucks. Eh, hey, worst things have happened. To... Yes, absolutely. Uh, right, sharing that scene now. Thank you. I don't think I have one for you to share at the moment. Well, that's fine. Okay. I think we should be ready to go. to the trader, but I didn't take a new quest, which is interesting. I'll come down. I think I'm still on level three, so. Whoa. Oh, oh, oh. It's okay. You wanna I'll pop the drawbridge up? Yep. We're already on it. Okay. Heading on out. Ah, oh, this thing looks amazing, though. Oh. I forgot I uh, wasn't in uh, mouse look mode. Look at that. That that was absolutely worth it to get this thing. All the effort that went into yes. to getting it. 100% worth it just for the look of us driving around in a death mobile. Wrong. This is absolutely fantastic. Also, we got a free tire with this. You realize? Because I only needed yeah. to make five wheels, but we've got a spare in the back. Ha <laughs> ha. Take that, game. Five wheels or four wheels? I only had to make four wheels, sorry. But we got a, a spare wheel. I only wheel had to make five wheels. I'm like, even with the spare, I don't need see five wheels. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> My mind was elsewhere. Uh, right. Now, let's have a quick look at the map a second. Where do I need to go? Uh, oh, we can go all the way down past the curve in the road, then take the, the next left. I can already okay. see it ahead of us. So this should That's not be a problem. That's how you kind of gravitate towards the left-hand side of the road. Well, although you're not at the moment. But it's actually a right-hand side of the road curve. Well, it's, it's because there's a, a curve over here, so... Yeah. You're just taking the racing line. But again, what on earth is that? Massive Some massive sinkhole. sinkhole, yeah. Car we could pull apart if we wanted to. But mostly I just want to do this quest so that we can go and accept I a level say, four. There's just so many millions of cars you could pull up. Ouch. You need 
Yep. Oops. Mm. I mean... 1% loss of health in the car. Yep. Uh, we've got a vulture who wants to play. Maybe we can get its feathers. We definitely need ammo for the next horde night. We do. Alright, the uh, quest is just over here. That vulture is not interested. Very well. He knows we need its feathers. Yeah. Another one over there, but we should be able to just um, head through this quest, honestly. Here we are. Right. There's already a zombie that's just woken up. Uh, let's just wipe you out quickly. Pop. There we go. Cool. Okay, you ready? Have you accepted the quest? I don't know. I will double check. <laughs> It'll probably be worth checking, yeah. Uh, tier 3 clear quest. Mm -hmm. Household bungalow 6. Yes. Okay. Activating the quest now. Well, there should be another zombie up here because there was one before. So sneaking through. Here she is. Oh, hello. Different one this time, but... Uh, there Same she place. goes. I can hear a vulture just above you, though. It's a clear quest. It looks like we want to jump up here and get into the house this way. Fair enough. This appears to be the way in. A collapsed something. I'm not exactly sure what. Oh, that was a terrible shot because I wasn't particularly aiming. Why can't I go down across there? Oh, that's so irritating. There we go. One vulture down. And well, that was a miss. And bingo, it's down. It's outside of the the area though, so we're not going to be able to take that. That's Hang on a second. Did we fail that quest already? No. Uh oh, it's because it it wasn't it wasn't my active quest, so it wasn't showing up in my radar. That was. Uh. That was deeply worrying, I'll be honest. My lord. Um, That should be all we realistically need on my hop out there. Right, heading through. We're starting from the top on this one. Oh, darn it. Right, you've oh, got a, a zombie. Like a leg there. Oh, it's down. Ah! Thank you. One right behind me. Oh, dear me. Oh, I fell down there. This is like really annoying. Yeah, this is, a, this is a difficult one actually. Where are you? Oh, I'm trying to get back onto the roof. Right, be aware that they're all awake. Okay. I think when the fall happened, it uh, alerted quite a lot of them. Are you inside? I'm really right. sorry about no, that. No, 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 no. Yeah, no. I'm inside now. No, it's it's fine. It's absolutely fine. But yeah, that's a difficult one to move across. We may get okay. jumped. I'm not even trying to sneak right now. I'm just moving in to try and get to you. Right, you got it. Well done. Give me a quick healing bandage. Yep, of course. You take your time. One down. Hopefully I've got the boom headshot on both of them. Two down. Got some 7.69 ammo on there. Right. I don't know if there's much reason to stay quiet this time. No. There's a lot going on in here, though. One down. Spider. Right, I got need to get through. No, I might. Well done. Is he dead? He is, but I'm not liking our chances here. Okay. There's just a lot of wanderers. None of them are feral yet. I'm using steel bolts, so they're going down quickly when they when they're hit. Um, this is a clear quest, so we don't need to worry too much. But there are mines in the house, apparently. And that just silenced a lot. Like of one them. of those barricades. Yeah. We're splitting up a bit, but right now I'm not no, I'm overly kind of you. worried. I can't seem to jump here, which is interesting. 
Uh, he's down. I think they're quiet. So we can return to moving slowly. The one that's making a noise, but we'll see. The main thing is that we are not in any immediate danger. If there's only one making a noise. There's nothing on there. Good. Yeah, half the house started making noise. Oh, wait, no. That, now there is. Ah, you know what? Yeah, I, I actually think I'm coming back up. I actually think what happens really is good. they spawn as you travel through the house. It's very interesting. Nice Switching to my pistol. I would be. Well done. Good. That woke everyone up. Probably did, yeah. Not too I'm worried about to that. Do that with irradiated, so. I feel that it's generally better if we do, yeah. One down. That was a spider. Very glad we're not having to do with that one. Right, from behind you. One. Two. There we go. Nice and nice. easy. Um, let's check out the room that the spider was in that I've already killed one from. None other in here, but I'll be sure. Sorry, I'm crowding the back of you there. Oh, that's okay. Something on the move in here somewhere. I've right, got a... Uh... Oh, feral. Oh, two. Ah. Switching. Pistol. Right, I'm gonna quickly heal up. We've got one coming from behind, from the door behind you. Slow mover, it's okay. Switching to my crossbow. Got it? Okay, yeah. you take that door, I'll take this one. So it's unlikely to be more around. Nothing in here, it's nope. fine. Got a sleeper over here. It is dead. Nothing on this side. Oh. Unfortunately, I uh, peeked over, uh, or rather, walked over the uh, sink, which will get everything up. Yeah. Yeah. Everything down in here? I think we're alright. Nothing in that suspicious wardrobe. Yeah, it doesn't look to be, but... No, there definitely is. Maybe jump when... Uh... There we are. She's down. I'm going to quickly yeah, have a look at my character. Maybe jump shot it, because I was like, oh, something just burst out of there. I'm so used to them being kind of crazy. Uh, I need a drink. I need food. Do you have any food on you? Yeah, of course. Stupidly, you seem to have eaten all my food. Thank you. You're welcome. Now, I'm not going to be worried too much about grabbing any loot this time through. But uh, the hidden bits of loot, absolutely. The specialist stuff. But I'm not going to be uh, taking apart all of the furniture or anything like that. Yeah, we I just don't think we need stuff, it anymore. But we don't need it, yeah. Pulling apart all of the it's chairs. Not like early and all that game kind of when you need like every glass bottle. Something is out here. So I'm quickly gonna wipe it out. It's just a visitor from outside. And there we go. It's down. We need to, we need to go. No, no, no. We need to go downstairs. We came from down, upstairs. It's, oh, it's down. Sorry. Yeah, we started at the top. You're right. Yeah. I do like that that happens sometimes, though. That sometimes you're going from the top, sometimes you come down from the bottom. Have you got sight on many? See, no, I can't see anything at the moment. Okay. Bit of a bit of a disco down here. I like. Um. Got. 
or a couple of uh, sacks and, and backpacks around here, but not too much else no yet. Zombies. I will grab the, the, the cement, though, while we're going through the concrete. See, they'll, they'll all be in the more, like, crowded space. Yeah, they will be. That is very astute. Bit of uh, bits down there, but nothing too interesting. Some small arms. All right. Looks like they're going to be through there. Do you want to go through first this time? Sure. Clear. There. Okay, yeah, following clear. through. Oh, this is the one when they're all down in the pit. Oh. I know. I know this point of interest. There's like okay. a million zombies down in this pit for some reason. If only I brought a pipe bomb. Oh yeah, I can see. And pop. There she's down. She is a uh, very specific spawn since I had actually removed that particular zombie model from the uh, from the game, but she must have uh, a spawn in this point of interest specifically, rather than any of the wandering ones. They, did you kill it? I am not even sure. Yeah, I am not going to crowd you. I think so. Okay. So shall I take a few headshots? Yeah, then? by all means. Nice kill. What I can do. Well done. Two of them are now active. Oh, they're on your level. At least it's showing them it's on your level. I wonder what the story is about this place though. Like they can't though. get to me. Yeah, it's weird. Because again, every one of these points of interest has a bit of a story to it. What was going on here? And the last one. What kind of zombie is it? Uh, just one of the thin, sort of okay. uh, bald ones. You've got to go down. Oh, never mind. Oh, do we? Okay. Sorry. Oh, that's fine. Water down there. But it looks like the uh, they were digging down to the water mains, perhaps? Yeah, there's spikes in the water that looks good as well. Really? Uh, I don't see any spikes. Oh, okay. But I wish I'd brought the buckets with me and put them in the in the cars I meant to. Because I want to create that water source. We're going to need water to fill said water source. Yes. Right, there's one more enemy. It is going to be up here. Right, I'm going to have to stop crouching for a moment. Hop up. Damn it. It's awake. So, zombie dog. Are you behind me? Oh. Sorry. Yeah, you need to warn me when you're doing that. Because you literally stopped me from backing up once again. You're right, Sheila. Yeah, I thought there was more than. No, no, the quest has been complete. Oh, I heard a, a zombie. It must be yeah. an outside Yes, yeah, an outside one. Uh, okay. Let's get through this. Uh, okay. Thing. Have you got an axe? Yeah, I'm just yeah. getting out. You really need to work on not not being right behind because quite often you're you you commenting on not being behind, which is really cool. But, uh, yeah, I know. I tell you when I'm not there. Yeah. There we go. Quite a few things in here. No point in uh, being stealthy anymore. Let's grab what we can. Burning shaft mod. Oh yes. Very nice. Um, a melee item can double as a light source and set enemies on fire. Right. Well, uh, actually, you've got a, a level six um, spiked thing, don't you? Here you go. Yeah. It's better for you. You've got the, mm -hmm. the higher strength, I believe. Yeah. Right. May as well grab the concrete over there. I know I said I wasn't going to pick all of this stuff up, but I am more by accident yeah. than anything else. <laughs> the uh, yeah, I am looking at you. The uh, the texture is all messed up on my side. Oh, is it? <laughs> that is hilarious, though. But uh, yeah, the nice thing about that is much like the torch, you can set things on fire with it, which is pretty bloody good. All things said and done, gonna start working through the safe. I think I can give you a hand with that. Right, yep. 
out. You are going to need to deal with that zombie before too long. But it'll probably well, work its way in by she's itself. annoying. Yeah, more because she's annoying than anything else. I'm stopping every now and then just to double check. Uh, mostly 7.62. Some arrows and uh, some oh, shots and stuff. Grab the cobble as well, since that is useful. Nothing else in here, really, I don't think. Okay, head on out then. We will grab any false floors or anything like that. I'm not going to grab the police blocks. I don't think that's really that necessary, honestly. There we go. The box, maybe, though. Yep, some 7.62. Are you alright getting up that area, Sheila? Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm in the room behind you. I'm good. Okay. Mostly looking for anything on the wall that might be false. Yeah. Again, yeah, not gonna go for the. Might have ammo. Not gonna try the uh, uh, washing machines. There's just no reason. However, well, taking the cardboard box had twenty pistol ammo. So that was good. Oh, nice. Yeah, the boxes will still have decent stuff in them. Shall my appliances. Definitely get this cobble. There is a... Poppin' Pills sealed chip and crate above. This is not a bad little place for the amount of loot that's in it. Oh, yeah. Just six bottles, unfortunately. We've got that one. The vending machine, pretty nice. Awesome. Some... Ammo in there, look like. Vending machine, no point in dealing with that. Ow, oh, cold beer. Steel. That looks way too conspicuous. Can. Now, that was a bit of a silly thing for me to have done because that could have caused that whole thing to collapse and just waste whatever was in it, but. It worked out for this. You in the end. Ooh, got a level five wrench there. That's quite nice. Well, that's all right. Yeah. That's better than what you had already, isn't it? And um, no, I've level, got a level five. Level six. Uh, I've got a level five actually. So that's just a, a spare level five. You either sell it or well, it sells for a couple of hundred. It's not terrible. Help you. Some blue dye. Do you have anything that needs to be dyed, Sheila? Probably. I'll have a look through like when we get back to you. Nothing right now. For now, I'll pop it on my uh, machete then. Right, the mines are gone in here, so we don't need to worry about that. Moving into the next room. Let's have a look up here. There's something up there. Right, there we go. There's some peas. It's actually significantly faster for me to just loot anything I see, even if it isn't worth me uh, uh, taking, just because it's just a matter of hitting R, and I will loot everything yeah. in, so in something. I will take apart the television. You think the stuff in the television is worth it? It's electrical components. They're a little yeah. bit more expensive to make than the mechanical components, so... I'm not even going to bother searching the, the, bath, uh, the toilet. There's absolutely no point in that. We are literally that surrounded that? by enemies. There was a mouldy backpack and I and I searched it. No, 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 no. They don't always have things, unfortunately. Yeah, so these panels, like I've not, I've taken them. I haven't taken them away, but I've got the bags from like the gaps. Ah, okay, cool. There's still a mine Front there. Door. Careful, there's still a mine by that spike. Oh, okay, thank you. Anything up there? Nope. Sometimes there'll be something on those lips at the at the top of the door structures. Yeah. 
that's worth trying to, to grab. Not always, though, as is the case right now. Um, what's in here? The top. Not really worth me grabbing. Not worth me grabbing. We have got a magazine, though. Uh, paper, not worth it. What we have over here. Uh, I will probably drop a lot of this stuff. Yeah. If I'm perfectly these, honest. These zombies, right? They're so um, noisy, but you'll probably find there's like three of them or something. Yeah. They're really not. <laughs> that glitchy texture is so amusing, though. That will probably fix itself, by the way. Yeah, maybe when we reload or something. Uh, small ammo part. Uh, some crossbow uh, bolts, that's not too bad. Anything in here? Medicine cabinets, totally worth looting. In fact, yeah, absolutely worth looting there. We've got a medical bandage. Backpacks. Oh man, my inventory is full. Concrete things are going everywhere. Don't want any of those. Oh, no. We've got another magazine to sell. Okay, this area is clear. How are you doing, Shilab? Ah, oh, just collecting some concrete and cobble and stuff. Let's go. I wonder how many zombies there are going to be outside. Uh, desk safe. It sounds to me like it's a horde or something. I know. It may well be a horde, actually. It's a very good point. Slowly working my way through a desk safe at the moment. So I'll be a little bit. Oh, hello. I can help you. This will go a lot faster with the two of us, yeah. There you go. There you go. Um, just a couple of bits of ammo, nothing nothing wondrous, unfortunately. Nah. Never uh, is. You get so excited about these safes. I know. When you see a safe, it is genuinely a moment of, of excitement. You think, right. oh, it's so good. It's I'm going to drop the bones. I'm going to drop the cloth. Don't need I'm going to drop it. Well, I'll keep the lead, I guess. I'm going to drop the paper. Don't really don't need that. The office chairs I'll keep because, you know, we're getting to the point now where we, we want to start making the, the base beautiful. You don't need corn seed. No, no, I can make corn seed. If it's GM corn seed, yes. No, it's just normal. That's fine. I think we're only really going to find that in one very specific or, or maybe two, uh, two specific points of interest, or if a trader sells it. But if we can get it. I just pick things up. I'm just like, oh cool. no, there's something on the floor. I need to pick it up. No! No, you don't, <laughs> Sheila. You threw it there for a reason. Yep. yep. And that's down. That's down. Nothing much else in here, I don't think. There might be something up there, but I suspect that was more of a place where a zombie was standing. There we go. And there's what? Anything in there? We've got... Medical supplies. Magic powder. Yeah. There weren't too many in here, honestly. It was a fairly straightforward point of interest as they go. It was a nice shape, though. I'm qu yeah. I'm quite fond of the ones that start at the top and then work down, just because it's a little yeah, bit of a deviation from the norm. I like the ones where you you, you enter the house externally through a wall or or some sort of other aperture that looks like someone made it a long time ago in order to uh, like escape. Or yeah, or for, for themselves to stay safe. Right, heading down. Are you still needing this kind of stairway? Nope, we can start pulling it down now. Oh, almost lost that, right? You've got to remember that if you uh, destroy it, it... I just... Uh, yeah, I wasn't sure whether we were still collecting the cardboard boxes at the end of the day. Uh, the cardboard boxes, yes, because these can have mechanical parts or all sorts ah, of things. Right, in them. Okay. I think I've even seen one that had, like, forged um, steel in it. Right. That's it. We're done. Hello again. Well done. Got another you one just around this corner. You're noisy. I don't like you. You've been causing all this noise. It makes you very stressed out. I know, right? 
Right, well, that's that done. We can head back to the trader. I can hand this in. I can get my level four. I'm really, Wonderful. really, really looking forward to that. Where's yeah, because that's oh, going to be really here. super interesting to do. You can also pick up a level four three when we get there as well. Mm -hmm. All of that noise. Well, just maybe I'll just, you. no, I was going to say, maybe I could just do your level four and see whether that pumps me up to level four quest. That's a good point. That's a very good point, actually, yeah. Because I may get the EXP for moving up a level, actually. I... Yeah. I mean, well, let's find the best route back to the trade there. Probably straight down this route, road, and then on. Okay, we're going off road. And we've got a four by four. Off road. There's no reason why we shouldn't. I like that house. Oh, I like that the look of that house a lot. Well, and the kind of more gothic architecture to it. Mm. Well, it's not strictly gothic, but more gothic. They're just going to drive over a most of the uh, debris here. A little bit awkward. To be I... honest, like, I do find if you've got enough repair kits, then you can just... I mean, the 4x4 four four is damage. is just tanking it. It's taking very little damage. Yeah. I mean, I don't want to hit a boulder, but the breeze blocks we just go through. And now the cars we just go through as well. He says, taking quarter of the health of the car. It's fine. <laughs> the thing is, like as I say, it is just a case of like a repair kit, and yeah. it's back up to one hundred percent. So yeah, exactly. At this stage of the game, it's not an issue. Gotta find warm clothing. This is the thing. We should really have made a car that was enclosed. Yeah. With like nice heating and things. Yeah, exactly. But this is so much faster. That being said, it's almost eight o'clock. Those mm -hmm. those quests still take a long time for us to go through. That's what I mean. Like the level fours, we'll have to leave like early in the morning rather than back in the bright until sort of eight or nine o'clock. Yeah, yeah. Because absolutely. they are going to take all day, and they're going to have hard zombies in them. Yes, they will be full of radiate, uh, radiated and ferals. Mm -hmm. There we are. All right, let's have a go and see what we can sell. Right, and also, buy. buy. If um, I level up at all. I shouldn't. I shouldn't be too bad. Day. Thank you. And here you go. Did the you level up? Launcher. The, um, oh, you haven't seen yet? No, I haven't seen yet. Do I want a rocket launcher or exploding crossbow bolts? Rocket launcher, because that's a weapon, I would say. I just dropped on the counter, don't worry. Yeah. I can pick it up for you That's if you a, want. I'll just like sell something to it. Yeah. I just picked it up so they wouldn't there wouldn't be a risk of it going anywhere. Um I'm gonna drop that bottom flash on the floor, don't need it. Actually kinda do if I want to make more hobo stew. I don't want any of my rubbish. It's just oh yeah, paper. There we are. You managed to sell the paper, did you? Yeah. I'm just uh, outside. Right, here's your rocket okay. launcher. Thank you. Uh, there you go. You could probably sell that if you really wanted to, but honestly, it's probably going to be fun to keep. You did it. Yeah, Good we might job, at some point Trevor. get the uh, bullets for it. Uh, I've got a SWAT helmet. I might take that. Or 13 Molotovs. We don't really use them, but uh, the, for the final Horde Night, we're probably just going to go bonkers, Yeah, we'll just so. throw everything at them. Right, any jobs? Uh, we've got a really close fetch and clear. They always yeah, give some decent that. EXP. Me with a problem. Yeah, and then we'll do that first thing in the morning. Yeah. Oh, okay, got it. Much. I will make it worth yes. your while. All right, let's have a look then, Jen. What have you got for me? You got some water turrets I could buy, a weapon flashlight. Now, oh, that isn't too bad. The weapon flashlights are mm. genuinely quite awesome. You used to just be able to put a normal flashlight onto a weapon, didn't you? Uh, yeah, you used to be able to do that, yeah. Uh, but now you need a specific mod. Should I buy that mod? It's only 440. Yeah, why not? Yeah, why not? We've yeah. got like 23,000 dukes in the base, you know? That is true. Uh, Anything you even mildly think you might want, we may as well buy. That's a good point. 
I could buy a sofa. Sure, I'm going to buy a sofa for the base. Well, at All some right. point, we're going to we're going to want it. I think. Um, I could sell off a bunch of uh, some leather gloves, and probably leather chest plates. That's what I'll grab. Um, no, I don't. So I'm going to buy that as well. Grave digger mod for my shovel. And that's it. You Nothing amazing in there, unfortunately. Yeah. Modify you. Oh, actually, um, when you're done. Oh, uh, no, no, man, I'll, I'll sell it because I've got slightly better odds of selling it. Um, I that. Could I put the weapon flashlight on my crossbow? I could. Just for a bit of extra. Not that I. I'm really at the point where I'm it. selling things just to get inventory space. <laughs> this is fantastic. I've got so many different lights on my weapons now, it's just kind of ridiculous. Um, but yeah. Oh, I've got some old cash I need to sell to her as well. Peace be with you, my friend. And sell all those. And is there anything else I wanted to sell? Uh, this wrench. May as well just get a bit of uh, cash for that. Okay. It's yeah, I'm ready to head back as soon as you are. You One book. It's almost time for night. Okay. So I should spend the night concreting up the base again. Yeah. And yeah, finishing absolutely. out one last room downstairs. By the time we get back, the table saw will be ready. So I should be able to upgrade the uh, the dump the chest area a little bit. Yeah. Let yeah. me to go do the drawbridge. Yes, please. I know my job. Thank you. I just need to carefully drive over that little little dip there. There we go. Perfect. Grab the fuel, refuel it. Right, let's have a quick look at you. Uh, defense is 90, which is glorious. Yeah, perfect. And drop that off. Okay, well, I didn't actually put anything into the 4x4 in the end, but that's fine. No, I didn't either. Oh. I was just about okay without going to use the inventory. Let's drop all of these off while we're here. All the smeltables. Of which there were a reasonable amount. Uh, the wrench can be smelted as well. Can Our sofa is going to go in the building chest. Or wood, if I had room. Um, actually, there's quite a few things in there that I'm going to want to be working on anyway, so I'll just take them out now. Make that all organized. Drop in the sofa. Drop the glass. And the brass. Okay, so you're going to be working on what was it tonight? Um, just more of the room. And just doing more of this uh, last room. Yeah, just okay. more flagstone in the walls up. Right, yeah. Facing the floor. Mm hmm. Sounds like a plan. We didn't do too bad for, for munitions out of that uh, run, actually. For a decent amount. Yeah, I'm okay for ammo right now. I've got like um, 107.62, 76 steel, 7.62, and then Very nice. 30 odd. Uh, pistol ammo, but I think you dropped me something back into the ammo chest in you or something. Yeah. And I don't think I picked that up, so that's why I'm a bit low on that, but yeah, pretty good other than that. I'm having to move 
quite a lot of uh, bits and bobs around right now in our food chest. I'm having to find new places for some things to live. Yeah. It's getting the a little done, bit full. Ooh, haha, fantastic. And can you? All right, let's pop this down in the corner. Concrete is done, or concrete put on, or whatever. Right. We can make all sorts of things now. A uh, wood arrow block. It is literally an arrow. A wood arrow slit. Some like proper stairs. All sorts of little bits and bobs. Um, a quarter block. Wood frame. It's interesting that you can make flagstone blocks without any requirement. But when it comes to wood, you need a table saw. Like you can, yeah, you can just fabricate it in your hand when it's uh, flagstone. It, it, it's always been a little bit of an odd one, that. In my opinion. Um, and you've got yeah, a lot of stuff awnings. Doesn't kind of make real world sense, isn't there? Yeah. Quite a few things like that. Uh, we could use... Some of these, actually. Uh, sure, I'm going to grab four of these. And two of these. There we go. This should make for a nice little spot in the uh, dump room. Do we not have nails? There we go. I got nails. I forgot what I was doing there. There we go. Neatly now then. Neatly. Come back to me, I'm sure. I need this to be advanced. Yeah, once I oh. sort this floor out, that'll be the last of it all. Uh, all done. Nice. Excellent. Like, lovely. And then it's just a case of going through as much iron as possible. Mine it all up. Okay, I, I am super think... looking forward to that level four quest. Yeah, really interesting. They should be very, very complex. the The points of interest should be much more interesting to navigate. One and two. There we go. This little room looks a little bit better now. I don't think we're going to need more than two jump chests, frankly. I'd be very no. surprised if that were the case. But also, it looks Even like it. We don't hoard it, that much. It looks like it is suspend. Uh, it is uh, held up in a realistic way, which was the important part for me. Um, now I'm going to need another bar. Unfortunately, there we go. Right. Once we've got all of this together, I think I wanted. Another four rebar frames as well for the support pillars over here. So one straight up there. Uh, oh, wait, no, this is a half block. It won't work. Right. Okay, well, those rebar frames are just going to have to sit there then because there's not much I can do about it. Oh, well. Uh, I'm going to need to go and grab the... Uh, nail gun. There you go. Now, I'm going to finish off the concrete on the internal wall, Sheila. Okay. Just I'll finish double reinforcing external. that. Externals do really well, though. Actually, I'm out of concrete already, which is kind of crazy, but all right. Not really. It happens to be a lot. When you're using like 10 per block, it, it goes That's fast. a good point, yeah. You do go through it crazy fast. Because you think, oh, I've got like 200, or that's 20 blocks or whatever, that's it. I'm going to set up the concrete to be mixed in different uh, amounts. Okay. Yeah, I set some up, like 400 or so. Yeah. I'm, I've spread them out across the two different uh, different 
mixes though, just so that it would get through it a bit faster. Oh yeah, it'll be a bit quicker then. Yeah, it'll be a lot faster like that. Turn that on. There we go. We're making more cement over time now as well. All right, not too bad. Not too bad. How are things going down in here? Well, I'm nearly done on the floor. Right, you. C oh, that's fantastic! You can reach the storage bins from here. Oh, that's. Oh, good. that is so good. I'm very happy about that. Uh, what I am going to want, though, is to use the table saw to make some different shapes for those areas up there. Uh, let's find the wedge. Yeah, we'll get the mine out now. I've got quite a bit of iron from this wall, so I'll go and pop that up into the forge in a minute. Excellent. Because if we can, we will use that to make steel reinforcements. So we'll take that around. Can't quite see the angle on that, unfortunately. Is that not advanced? It's not advanced, is it? No. There we go. That particular rotation I would like over on this side. Uh, you know what? I'm not going to take the risk. Because there's every possibility that would just cause this to collapse. There we go. I'll just rotate through every... Well, actually, if I switch it to simple and then back to advanced, I should get back to that angle a little bit faster. There we go. So, you know, in... Um... Alpha 18, it's now got these, uh, you can just change the block shapes and things. I think yep. the table saw is a bit of a moot point now. Uh, yeah, I imagine so. I imagine you don't need a table saw given that. That's a very good point. I hadn't even considered that. That's a very, very good point. I wonder. Uh, the 33 iron spikes are still there. Would you like me to go oh, out and place them? So hard. Yes, please. <laughs> There's only three to place, really, but uh, unless you want to put some new ones in. Do you uh, have any wood on you? Uh, yes, I, I do. Need to get some more. Uh, I'll drop that where I'm stood. There you go. Thank you. I was just to do the floor. Sure, no problem. Right, you wanted all of these spikes placed, and there were three spots you said. Yeah. And there's actually quite a bit of um, damage to some of these spikes, so I'll. Uh, Go through and repair what I see. Really, I should have put on my night vision so I don't have to have my torch on while I'm out here looking for things that need repairing. Yeah. Oh well. I'm sure I won't okay, be eaten I'm sure by zombies. The zombies will leave you alone. Yeah, I know. Why would they? Why would they bother me? Exactly. I'm completely harmless. I would never build a death trap dungeon. No, you are the zombie's friend. I mean, depending on if they enjoy being a zombie or not, I might be. Maybe I'm giving them sweet seceits from sorrow. They never asked for this. They never wanted it. They just woke up one day with his insatiable hunger for human flesh. Pretty Powerless. Sure if I was made into a zombie, I wouldn't want it. I'd be like, no. See, I wouldn't be able to do anything about it. Then there's other people who will be like, finally! Finally, no one can tell me not to eat people. This is the greatest day ever. Uh, there is definitely a witch around here somewhere. Oh, no. Why? Why? I'm going to pretend I didn't see that. I'm going to pretend that I don't know that it's the wrong way around. Yes. Never even going to look at it again. I'm never going to come around the tree lab side of the base ever again. It's the only way. Oh, I'll be so lonely. Right, uh, there is definitely a witch out there. Don't know on what side she's at though. Making my way over to what I can only assume is the only place that the uh, missing. Oh damn it! Ran out of forged steel to affect with this. Are you sure this there's missing spikes? I'm not seeing them. There she is. Did you, did you replace any spikes? No? Yep. There's only three. Oh. Okay. Oh, great. You just, while I was out. Sheila, why? I'm sorry. Why I'm would sorry. you do this to I me? 
Such a scallywag you are. I was being all super stealthy. Ah, poop. I just and walked I out of the base and then all of a sudden... Oh, man. I just said. There is a witch out here. I'm going to take her down quietly. Oh, I'm sorry. So yeah, I was just secretly trying to kill me. Yeah, I've been doing that for the last few episodes, actually. Much more uh, effective when, when you... Uh, don't try to be secretive, honestly. Trying to take down what the zombie cop there, before he starts spitting at us. Zombie cop is the high threat she lab. Okay, incoming. Oh, well done. Yep. I was just lining him up. It, I, I, it takes me a while sometimes to line things up right. No, that's fine. I, I didn't realize because you hadn't communicated to me that you'd seen him or you were aiming at Sorry, yeah. I, I, I could hear No, I only just saw him and I was lining up and then I... Yeah, him. no worries at all. Because you mentioned him. It was just the... Uh, I was, like, I was worried he was going to start spitting at you. And if you weren't aware, yeah. you wouldn't know to dodge. Okay. I can take we got any more living zeds? Yes, we do. There we are. I think... There's a mo down the bottom as well. Oh, is there a mo? Okay. Is he down? No. Oh, I see him. Stupid mo. He's only like a little... I don't think I've finished him off, though. I think I just caught him on the side. Bit... They can be a little bit uh, tanky, those moes, can't they? Yeah, they're, they're one of the more tanky ones by far. There we are. All of the spikes have been restored, so we should be good. Wonderful. Right. So you found the three that were missing down this side. Uh, they were they yeah. they were a couple of spots, but they they it didn't seem that many, honestly. No, no, there was only literally like a, a space of about three. Okay. And well, I wasn't again, too bad I'd then. done the rest. Yeah. I did run out of forged iron though to repair. Um. A couple of the the ones that remain, but there we go. That's okay. Boxes are up and raised. We should now be able to interact with them comfortably. No. Okay. Uh, oh, is it not working? No. It looks like the grate oh. does not allow you to interact with it. With it. That is so vexing. So that incredibly so vexing because it it allows it in other ways. Hmm. All right then. Um, there have to be a hole. Yeah. Change of plan. I, I I just built the 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 iron bar as well. It's so annoying to have to go through it again. But all right. No, it's, we we yeah, can make this work. It's much better if like you don't have to fall into a hole just to access your boxes and stuff. <laughs> but. I can make this even prettier. Turning a defeat oh. into victory. I see. What are your plans? I'm going to use the corner blocks to create the uh, the apertures. Oh, mm, thank you so much, Sheila. How many of these are we are we getting rid of? All of them, are we? Hang on a second. Why can't I not access? Oh, there we are. Yeah, we are getting rid. Unfortunately, all, yeah, all of, all them. of them. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's I so annoying. I don't want to like, damage anything that I wasn't going to see. So. Oh, thank you so much. Um, two heads are better than one in this uh, instance for two say. sets of stamina. I think my couch is thirsty, yeah, yeah. I wonder if the arrow slits would work. I'll build one to test. So as soon yeah, as we've dug through this, that might work. If the arrow slits work, I could even put them up there. I'd have to change the block a bit, but that might look even better. Right, okay. Bear with me a second. Right, let's turn this into advanced mode. No, nope, the other way around. There we go. Yeah, sometimes it's just a case of finding the block with the sort of correct permission to... Uh, yeah, you can. If you crouch, you can oh, you can nice. do it. But over here, uh, yeah, yeah, you can crouch through. You can't do it with the iron bars, but you can through the arrow slits. Okay, cool. All right. I mean, it's not ideal, but it's 
not awful either. Should I get rid of the rest of the iron bars still, or just some? Yes. Or? Yeah, yeah, all of the oh. iron bars do need to go, okay. yeah. That is fine. We'll be replacing them all with uh, arrow slits. And the arrow slits. I'm glad you found a solution that didn't mean us like falling into the hole. I mean, I had another another option as well that was yeah. still open to us, but uh, I mean, this this works. We've been slowly making our way and and, and getting back. I think I may actually just leave that as it is, though, because I kind of think it looks nice. Uh, the alternative is to have um, two arrow slits going straight across. Maybe that would work. I don't know. Uh, we'll see. Don't worry about it. You, as, like you see, you spent ages making it look nice. So. There we go. But yeah, it is a little bit of a little bit vexing how the it works for some things, but not for all. The fact that we could yeah, interact with the motorbikes, but then couldn't interact with the the vehicles. Yeah, because then you build something and you're like, well, now it doesn't work with the new thing. Yeah, exactly. I was super excited about. Okay. I mean, this still gives us uh, an aperture through which we can easily drop things into the uh, storage areas. Goodness me! I know. The episode already. I know. It kind of snuck up on us there, didn't it? Yeah. There we go. That is all sorted. Dunk. Uh. Dunk. And now we can look through and well, those ones don't aren't really use useful. The storage box. Perfect. These ones on the sides not quite as useful, but you can sort of see down and that's kinda of cool. In fact I could have left the bars on the sides given that then. But ah well. Um I think that is a better looking setup than than otherwise. I could maybe replace the bars on the side. Just so, so that you can see what's down there, but you'd have to use the arrow slits to, to drop things in. Maybe. Yeah, I wouldn't we'll, worry about we'll, it too much. We'll see in the future. That might be something that I'll, I'll play around with if I get plenty of time. But so far, the uh, the concrete along the inside of the base now is uh, looking very, very nicely reinforced. Still got a tiny bit of just regular cobblestone to, to reinforce, but other than that, I think we're doing a really good yep. job right now. Yeah, we're doing great. Okay, so uh, you want to head off on the level 4 quest in the next episode. Is that right, Sheila? Yeah, I do indeed. Okay, well, uh, then that's what we're going to be doing. I hope you're looking forward to that, everyone. I hope you have enjoyed today's episode, though. But until next time, and as always, do take care. And keep being awesome.